And Las Aldas Marinas is uh, looking to get back on the winning track. And here oh. you go. This is the first basket courtesy of Sean Besagas. And uh, Sean Besagas, normally a guy coming off the bench, but this time earning a starting role and uh, immediately making his presence felt. Possible end one of chance right here for Sean Vesagas. Sean Vesagas is one of the energy guy of La Salle das Marinas. So, uh, lane think... violation here, so what other chance for Vesagas to score for a, for a three point play opportunity? Yes, it does. And nothing but net on that free throw shot of Sean Vesagas. A good looking free throw mechanic for him. It has been the practice so far of teams to start with an early press. Just to <laughs> Ames with Boa and a steal here by Alaurin. Gives it to wow. Vesagas. <laughs> Just like what I said earlier, and, uh, Besagas with a nice fast break finish, but this time that is the second in the game for him. Oh, and a good pass there coming from Buado, but on the other end, it's Sean Besagas answering for two. And uh, Besagas has been the finisher for La Salle so far. The energy guy Vesagas really carrying the offensive oh. load for De La Salle yeah, Desmarinas. Look at Alaurin. Vesagas fakes, floats. Wow. And another score for Sean Vesagas. He has been steady so far, and that is, I'm speaking about Vesagas. Alexis Heeman left the finish is no good. And still uh, running up and down here. Back for Alexis Heeman. Uh, Heeman's resiliency in getting that uh, second chance uh, opportunity resulted wonders for uh, Ames. Uh, but again, Besagas, the finisher for La Salle, doing what, is, what he does best. And Vesagas not yet done in doing Manangkil is good. Showing his range is Manangkil. Uh, a while ago, he was able to pose up at this time. It's uh, around from the 17 feet. The elbow. Montes. Oh, Vesagas. Vesagas, La Salle das Marinas. And don't look now, it's just a three-point lead here being enjoyed by La Salle. And a big stop there by Reyes. That's... Reyes. Now it's Besagas who scores wow. for two. Challenging the defense there was uh, Boado was Besagas. Oh. Two on one fast break there by him. Cutting the lead down again to three points. As we see Besagas. But Besagas. Guys to have a decent shot from the perimeter. You know? But uh, on the other hand, it's a... Uh, it, the big man now has uh, truly evolved uh, with, with the... Aurin handed off to Vesagas. Step back. Give it back to Alaurin oh. for three. And that was a big makeup for Alaurin for his early blunder. This time around, knocking down a, a while ago. He was able to knock down trees this time around with a short stab. And an exciting last two minute mark that's brought to you by Durings Barbecue and Restaurant. Time, time down to the last five seconds in the shot clock and Besagas piercing the defense of Ames Sean, and bringing back the lead to La Salle. Sean Besagas with 19 points. Sweet touch for De Los Santos. Alexis Hima loses it. Keep the ball. Peralta from way out. We'll get it. Ball possession goes to De La Salle. And La Salle winning. And a grab here. Let's yeah. wait for the official call, I think. And Coach Tito Reyes is livid. Asking for an unsportsmanlike foul to be called on Manangkil. He grabbed uh, Besagas. Besagas. 
It looks like uh, there's going to be a verdict. Uh, Let's wait for the official call. So Ray, my run kill really grab Sean Vesagas on his jersey and put his down, put him down. But I think it's going. It's it is a preve preventive foul uh, given by uh, Malangkil. But uh, we don't know if it's going to be called for sportsman like foul. And that's the fifth foul of Manangkil. Manangkil. So and that is going to be big uh, because he has been the he has been the source of production inside for uh, Ames. That's right, Sir Ray, with 12 points and 7 rebounds. So what's the call? Is, is it a, is it an unsportsmanlike foul? Looks like it is. Yeah, it is an sportsmanlike foul yeah, called against a, Manankil. So a big break here for Lasal and bad luck there for Ames. It's a crucial foul made there by Joseo Manankil. So Besagas is now trying to create some separation here with his two free throws, making this... And back here at Olivares College at Pasig City, we have here our winner, the De La Salle University player, Sean Vesagas. Sean, you really did well for today. You and your team placed well against Ames Blue Shark. A close battle, but you did 20 points on this game. A different day coming from you, Sean. What did you do to prepare for this game? Uh, first of all, uh, I believed in myself and you... Um, confidence that my teammates and my coaches gave to me, uh, the support that we, uh, that has been given to us from the SDO, Sir Jerry and uh, uh, Mama and uh, to all our um, parents, um, they gave us the support and the confidence we need to win this game. Uh, Sean, uh, you were uh, looking for a breakthrough win. Uh, you 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 won last time and then you coming off a loss again and now looking for a, for another win uh, to get back on track you know? so what was your mindset uh, then uh, for you to be more assertive more aggressive on the offensive end uh first of um, when we won the game uh, against ayak and then we lost the next game to uh, icc uh, we made sure that we had the win uh, door die mentality especially the upcoming games that uh, all of them are winnable uh, we have to um, double our efforts especially in practice uh, to be able to compete for the final eight. And Sean, we want to thank you and congratulate you as well in winning this game. And I will give you your time right here to thank all of your fans and also to, uh, to all of your supporters to also watch here 